all kind of state law enforcement here today. I don't know why they would be here now, do you? Must be for criminals like me who are looking for oil. seem to be meeting the people coming in with their boats. Um, hmm. Checking their catch maybe, making sure they don't have anything that might have oil on it and incriminate anyone. God forbid. Are they checking everybody's catch? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Checking yeah. Everything. For what? Like, yeah, they're checking everything. For everything. what? Because they want to be... Ain't got nothing else to do. Yeah. Safety inspection. Yeah. Safety inspection. They, 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 they checked our life jackets, 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 flares, fishing licenses, catch, beer. They arrested several of my friends the other day. Um, they, they went out and they were testing for oil, you know, and they had their anchor and they took some of that um, aquarium, um, you know, that aquarium... Uh, filter stuff. Yeah. They put it on the bottom of the anchor and they threw it out and they pulled up accidentally like five or six dead oysters. I mean, there was no oyster in the shell, right? DMR and all that came out there and freaking arrested them for taking oysters. <laughs> yeah, it took them all to freaking uh, Harrison County Jail. No, they, they checked everything. They even come over and go, how many people is this boat rated for? And the oh boy goes, seven people or 10,000 or 1,050 pounds. Right off the bat, nailed it. And they were like, oh, right. The president whip out a scale and weigh you. <laughs> God dang, man. Everything right now. So if you're coming in fucked up, you're getting in some trouble. Oh, yeah. We just bought a fishing license six hours ago. We were fishing all summer. Oh, well, it's shit. We, we saw them when we first came in this morning. They were all over the place. We are like, we'll go buy a fishing license. Yeah. That's a joke, man. They tell, they tell everybody that the water's open for fishing, and then they, you know. They arrested a bunch of people in Florida this morning, too, um, uh, for, okay, they told them, they, they were on the beach and they had a shovel, right? And they told them, uh, you can't dig on the beach. And they said, well, what do you mean? You know, we, you know and they said, no, you, you can't look for oil. You, you, can, you know, and he says, well, what if my kids dig with a shovel in the sand, you know, to make a sand castle, right? And, and uh, the guy, I mean, they have all this on YouTube. You know, and then um, the, the guy goes, uh, no, you you know, um, I'm going to have to call a law officer. You cannot dig and you cannot look for oil. But yeah, that's exactly what I come here looking for, you know. Uh, yeah. <laughs> it's like, okay, you know, but, but there isn't any oil, right? That's what you tell us. There's no oil here. So, what the, I don't know, stupid, stupid. Y'all have a good day. Make it hard for us to have a good time, don't they? <laughs> yep, they are checking everybody as they come in and uh, trying to trying, I guess, to make revenue and tell every tell everybody what they can and can't do. You know, they open the waters. There you go. They're checking the next boat coming in. Gonna try and arrest everybody for everything. Why don't they start arresting the goddamn politicians for what they've done? Why don't they go and arrest BP? I am sorry, but this is just... Beyond belief. Beyond, beyond. Garbage floating in the surf. Hermit crabs coming out of the water to get out of it. Littered, littered, littered with tar balls. Just littered with it.
Doesn't get better. Do you see anyone cleaning up? I sure don't. I guess the general public is supposed to come out here and take our lives into our hands and we're supposed to clean it up now. Florida. Thank you.